Good. Here is the KISS puzzle. Uh, this is from Vinco. And it's a really unique looking puzzle. Now some of Vinco's other stuff is coordinated motion or packing puzzles. I'm not totally sure what this one will be. And it actually, uh oh, looks like it's partially apart in the box. That's, oh boy. And now it all came apart. So, now it makes this like weird geometric shape. You'll kind of see it here as I put it together. But I'm really, there's gonna be a point here where it all, oh boy. Okay. So let's take a look at the picture. That's the, the shape it makes. And it looks like just this cluster of balls that are connected by rods. And I'm really not sure how, hmm. This is a very unique, very different puzzle from some of the other stuff I've seen from Vinco. And you can kind of feel it, like it's an odd thing here when, it, when I'm playing with it, you can kind of feel points where it like gets solid or make it like kind of the shape solidifies in it. Huh. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna put this one here. I'm gonna go grab another KISS puzzle because I just want to see see what it looks like together. So let me run downstairs. I'll be right back and I'll grab you another one. Okay. So got you another kiss puzzle. Let's uh, take a look at it. Now I actually do notice it's a five difficulty. So this is as difficult as Vinco gets. Oh, and it looks like, shoot. This one is also a part. Huh. So maybe, maybe it doesn't hold together super well, like air solidly. Let's, uh, let's keep going here then. Take a look and see. So it's hard to know just how, how solid the shape will be. Like, I'm not sure if it'll actually click into place then, or if it kind of loosely holds together in a shape. Or not. Hmm. <laughs> I felt like I had something there for a second. I'd actually say this is very similar to, in some ways, to the um, Pfeffermeister, I think. It's that uh, candy cane stick from uh, Jean-Claude. And so it's got five pieces. It's very similar to this in some ways because the, the five pieces, it's like these five metal rods that are all the same shape and you kind of get them together and they all feel really loose and then it all tightens up right away and you get it, get it in and it snaps in place. So I'm wondering if this isn't going to be kind of like that where it's all loose and then eventually snaps back in and you can feel it kind of, kind of hit that spot where it uh, sticks together. You can kind of see a bit of the shape come together there. Huh. Huh. Let's see. So I figure, I figure that first one should be like a cross like that. Let's put a second one in like that. To cross it there. And I think maybe if I did some on the di diagonally from, huh, no, it doesn't look like they fit in diagonally. So let's just try again, I'll just try mash it all together. <laughs> Man, that's difficult. I can see why this gets a five rating, that's for sure. Not easy. See, like there, I can almost feel like there's something coming together there. And I think that these sh sticks kind of have to, they're going to have some sort of geometric shape inside there that, that they make. It's obviously not going to be just randomly jumbled together. Boy, that's difficult. I, I am not going to have any, any luck getting this together, I don't think. But there is six pieces, so six of these 
shapes. There's six of these um, balls with a piece in between, like a piece of dowel. So there's six of them. Yeah, so that's the uh, kiss from Vinco. Oh, look at that. It actually does come with the solution on the back here. Or gives you an idea. I, I imagine this would be like some of the other puzzles too where it almost becomes a dexterity puzzle. And so, uh, yeah, not an easy puzzle. As hard as Vinco gets there, the kiss puzzle. So let's kind of put her back in the box and move on. Ha, 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 ha.